So we are an education finance impact business. We see that disadvantaged need higher education more than ever, uh, but their barriers to that is having the money to spend on a college degree or when you're in your early career, you know, upskilling to improve yourselves and get ahead in your career. That brought about, of course, the I, not just the idea for Invested, but why we exist in today's post-pandemic world. So in terms of education financing in the Philippines, what we really saw is that the youth are financially excluded. When you're a young person from a low-income and poor family, uh, you know, a student, a college student actually can't just walk into a bank and ask for a loan. You know, when we were building Invested, uh, we were very hyper-focused on solving the problem of education finance. And we always knew that as an institution, what we needed to do for this problem to be solved was that we needed to unlock the whole financial industry to let capital flow into disadvantaged students. And that's our, that's really the core of what we do at Invested. We are an impact business. We do the lending ourselves to students. But at, at the end of the day, what we're trying to solve is that risk problem of education finance. Diversity is pivotal in solving systemic problems. For us, we have a multidisciplinary team. This is what enables us to really create very customer-centric products. So, for example, the invested team, like there's one-third who are engineers, very quantitative. One-third are actually like uh, from the social sciences. And then there's the one other one-third, you know, from business, economics and so on so when all of these disciplines come together it's, it's very beautiful in achieving systemic change like going back to the team apart from having that diverse background we're very particular at invested to make sure that our team has a shared background with our students so the the team members of invested are you know they either experienced financial hardships also when they were in school. And so they're very, they're not just aligned and a believer of the mission, they understand it deeply. And we also have team members who may not, you know, who may not have experienced financial hardships, but they've had a lot of community work before. And so they understand deeply the market and you know the community we're trying to serve again it was it was very important in the early stage of building this business with my co-founders that we had the mentors to tell us that we actually had the potential to succeed i always reiterate this being told by successful people that you can succeed is very powerful and, and being told that, you know, you have a wonderful idea that you should pursue it, that encouragement and empowerment is really pivotal to anyone's journey towards their dreams. So, so yeah, it's very important. And what we're seeing also with our students at Invested is that, you know, access not just to financing, but also mentorship is very limited for the masses. And it's also one of the chronic things we have to address in order to really enable our young people, our young generation to succeed alongside their financial assistance from us. We ensure that they also receive coaching and mentorship so that they can maximize their potential in this very difficult job market and very volatile world. My advice to aspiring female entrepreneurs is to remember that you have the power to write your own story. I think one of the main challenges that us women entrepreneurs face and also actually any women are the mounting pressures that we feel and the multiple demands uh, that we have to fulfill in our lives, right? And uh, what I want to say is that your story is your own. 
you have the ability and the power to craft your story how you want your life to be to, to how you want your life to become and you just need to really believe in yourself and give yourself the opportunity to do so so listen to your inner voice and find inspiration in your inner voice because that's very powerful and use that power to really write your own story and pursue what you want to pursue especially if that thing you want to pursue creates a lot of impact in other people's lives